He just seems so alone. Well, at least he's doing a lot better. I just wish they could take some of those machines out of him. Oh, but darling, they're helping him. Kevin's the one who helped. Gave him the strength to keep fighting. I like to think it was Duke, his dad. You know, I've been thinking I gotta fill out the birth certificate soon. I want his last name to be Buchanan. Oh, but darling, I, I think this is too important a decision for you to make when you're so overwrought. Now, what are you talking about? Why wouldn't Zane be a Buchanan? Dorian, don't you think it's time that you shelved some of this animosity that you feel towards our family? No, I don't think the baby should be called Buchanan. But it's not out of animosity. It's really an issue of feminism. Because if Kelly is going to be raising this baby all on her own, well, I think it should have her name. And I think Duke would have been proud of this baby, Dorian. I think he would have wanted the whole world to know that Zane was a Buchanan. Absolutely. Having said that, yeah. it's Kelly's decision. Yes, absolutely. Hi, darling. Uh, by the way, speaking of Buchanans and sons... What? You got the results back? Uh-huh. Hey, hey, Spencer? A Buchanan? No, thank God. You mean Spencer isn't Ace's son? <sighs> Dad, are you sure? I'm positive, because the testing was done by two independent labs. Oh. <laughs> Wow, that is good. That is really, really good news. Tell him, how's the baby? Oh, he's he's doing much better. We we thought that we lost him, but he's he's improving. That's great. You know, I, I wish I could call John right now and tell him about Spencer. I know. You know, Spencer's case would be very complicated if all the witnesses that were testifying against him happened to be his relatives. I bet Grandpa was relieved, huh? Uh, yeah, yeah. He, he was also furious that anybody would think that he could father a psychopath like Spencer Truman. <laughs> and how did Spencer react? Uh, well, he kind of lost control. Grabbed your mother. What? No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Well, thank heavens for that. Well, what would they do to him? David calmed him down. Um, and then he was taken back to jail. I hope he spends the rest of his miserable life. Jeez. Not as a member of our family. Two miracles in one day. <laughs> we are truly blessed. So what was it like when Spencer got the news? Well, Spencer was shocked. And I've never seen him like that. He truly believed that he was Ace's son. Well, his mother told him that on her deathbed. You know, only a mother of Spencer Truman could do something like that to her own son. Honey, she must have been very, very angry with Ace to have done that. And obviously did not know how to forgive, forget, and move on. Hi, everyone. Hey. I guess this wasn't an original idea. Oh, how's the baby? Oh. Well, his heart rate is stabilized. His lungs are okay so far. We are cautiously optimistic. Yeah, but he's got a long ways to go, obviously. Oh, he's gonna make it strong. He's a Buchanan. Oh, and guess what? Spencer Truman isn't. Uh, the DNA test was negative? Um, oh, my God. It's a uh, load off. You didn't need an evil uncle running around at your wedding, did oh, you? I'm so happy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Stop, will you? Now. Tomorrow's going to be the happiest day of your life. And we all want that for you. That's right. This family could use a full day of happiness, trust me. Oh, but I guess you're not going to be there, right? Well, that depends if Kelly and the baby oh. are doing okay, you know? Of course I want to come. I want to be a bridesmaid so bad. I'm so <laughs> bummed I'm not going to be able to be there. But I just, I wish you so much happiness with your new family. You know what? I wish you the same thing. Just look at that little fella. Whether he's called Kramer or Buchanan. He's a fighter. You can just see. He's fighting to survive. You know, somebody up there knows that we need that baby. And he needs us. I couldn't have said it any better. 
All right, Kevin Kelly, if it's all right with you, we're going to take off because Vicky and I have something special planned tonight for Jessica and Antonio. Oh, yeah, of course. I just wish I could be there. Oh. Hey, you take care, all right? Okay. If you need anything at all, you call my cell, okay? All anything. Right. Thanks, Mom. Well, I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to be here. And if there's something that Vicky was going to do for you, but she's now too busy because of the wedding, you just let me know because I've canceled everything and anything. <laughs> Thank you, Dory. Oh, um, I would like very much to give Jessica and Antonio a gift. Would that be all right? Dorian, I think that would be lovely. They would appreciate that. Thank you. Good. Okay, you kids take care. All okay. right, see you later. Oh, one other thing. Clint, I am so happy that it turned out that Spencer is not Ace's son. And Vicky, I'm, I'm very happy that he didn't hurt you today. Well, thank you, Dorian. Thank you. Okay, you need some rest, so let me take you to your No, room. I'm not leaving my son. Uh, honey, you know, you really could do some rest, so I'll take the night shift. The right? only thing that will happen if I go back to my room is I'll lay in my bed and think about what's happening with my son and if he's okay. No. He's going to be okay. And then once you take him home, you're really not going to get any sleep. I'm not leaving. All righty. When you make up your mind, there's no changing it. So if you're determined to stay here, you just let me know what you want me to do. Actually, and I, I mean this in the nicest possible way, Dorian, the best thing you can do to help us is just go home. So you're going to allow Kevin to kick me out of here just when you need me? Dorian, I appreciate everything you're doing. I really do, but... You have to stop making these snide remarks and, and little cracks about the Buchanans. My son is a Buchanan, and he's in there fighting for his life, and Kevin helps him. So the hell that Kevin put you through is all in the past? You really don't understand what we were going through at that Kelly, time. Kelly, she's right about what happened no, back then. No, no, Kevin, no. When you held Zane in your hands and his heart started beating faster, I... I knew then that it was, it was like a sign. It was like, it was like someone was saying, all is forgiven, all is forgotten. Duke was there. He was there through you. And you know what I've been through and how much I've wanted a child. So please understand why I just want to spend some time with my son and with Kevin. <laughs> okay, sweetheart. I'll go. But if you need anything, anything at all, let me know. I love you okay. so much. I love you too. believe it. Dorian asked me if I would allow her to give Jessica a wedding present. Well, she's pretty much on the outs with the people she cares about. Maybe she was just trying to make amends. Oh, Clint. You know, for a really intelligent man, you are absurdly naive. Everything Dorian says when she's around you is for your benefit. She's sucking up to you. 